units heading down third. Looks like our old friend Hermit Schultz is at it again. Shocker! Didn't he just get paroled? Yeah, well, I guess it didn't take. No worries. Herman's just a big cupcake. I'll have him back in Rikers by bedtime. Just give me a second. Just had dinner with my ex after saving her from mass criminals. And now I'm gonna go beat up a maniac who uses shockwaves to rob people. What a perfectly normal life you have, Peter Parker. Damn, this one is really far off. Do we have a uh, quick time? Wait, what's that? Okay, that's peace over there, but quick time. Quick travel. No, there is not quick travel. Ugh, God. Dang it. Available units. Possible narcotics there reported. Location Where? In the vicinity of Devil Sh Peter. I just want to make sure you I haven't left any it. equipment you built for your friend around the lab. It's no bother to me, but if the grant committee stops by again. Don't worry, Doc. I make a point not to leave anything there. But I know my friend appreciates you looking out for him. There's a lot of people who don't like him very much. That buffoon Jameson and his audience of sheep? Please. The people who do great things in this world are those who don't let bullies like him stand in their way. People like us. You said a mouthful, Doc. Take care. This did keep these wannabe pushers in check. Wait a minute, what's that feeling? Do I... Wait a minute! It's just a goof. I wasn't gonna buy nothing. Hey, guys! You got prescriptions for this stuff? Here we go. Ha! The turn of the spider Nope, nope, nope. Nope. She'd never admit it, but the chief was warming up to Spider Cop. His casual disregard for by the book thinking was a breath of fresh air. She'd come around someday. Hey, we don't need you here right now, right? Can it, officer? That's all Pell's kitchen. What do you know about that? Oh, well, at least you're not oh boy. Whoa! What the? Just really? Get your ass on out of here. Enough of that. Oof. Glad I stopped that. Too many crazy drivers in the city as it is. <laughs> we'll see about that. Oh boy. Hi, Herman. Seriously? Give it up. You're never gonna catch me. That's what you said last time. I don't wanna hurt you. You'll just blow me down. Wow. That's, that's considerate. awfully considerate. Conversation. I'm done talking. But this could be so much more rewarding if we connected on an emotional level. Wait, I forgot. You don't have emotions. Come on, Herman. At least talk to me so we can make it. Knock it off you. Now let's talk. I said I'm done talking. Noted. Again. You know the police are watching your every move. I mean, we all know you're kind of dumb, but I didn't think you were this dumb. You must be desperate, which means you're not just stealing for yourself. You must be working with someone, or for someone. 
you can tell me who it is now, or make me punch it out of you later. Your choice. Move, move, move. Now, really, that was rude. Get your ass back in. Oh, ow. Okay, that's how it's gonna be, huh? Yes. Come here, bitch. Nope. Uh oh. Stop, 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 you know what, stop. You have like zero personality, but your suit is awesome. Can we talk design details? <laughs> Maybe later. Good work, Spider-Man. Did you learn anything about his motive? I tried, but he's not very talkative. Plus, I think he hates me. You have that effect on a lot of people. But you, you love me, right, Yuri? I tolerate you. Wow. That might be the nicest thing you've ever said to me. Shocking comeback indeed. Looks like I got some free time. Maybe now's a good time to look into that mask. Oh, it's MJ. <clears throat> what? Hey, MJ, you're up late. Just catching up on the news. Looks like you had quite an adventure with Shocker tonight. Yeah, he was unusually combative. Anyway, thanks again for dinner. What do I owe you? How about a favor? You still have that mask from the gallery? Yeah. I'm actually on my way to the Feast Center now to ask Martin Lee about it. Martin Lee? Why? He has a degree in art history. If anyone knows about the origins of that mask, he will. Just keep me in the loop. Like I said, I think there's a bigger story here, and I plan to be the one to break it. Uh, sure. Uh, sure. So I can call you, like, whenever? Yeah, whenever, whatever. I'm sorry, why did you break up so again? I guess we're talking again. Cool. We got this, Spider Man. Thanks anyway. No, you do not have this tower, though. There we go. Gentlemen, afraid I've got to ask you to leave the store. Bye. Our resting fist brought all the small timers out of the woodwork. Did it really? So, Peter, you do all I do for you. I'm sorry to bother you, Mr. Lee. I have a friend, Mary Jane. She's a reporter. She's doing a story on art imports, and she found this piece. And she wanted an expert opinion on it, and I know you have a degree. And this might be the first time I actually get to use it. Let's see what you have. Interesting. Where did she find it? Uh, I'm really not sure. What, what is it? replica of an antique Chinese opera mask. I haven't seen one in years. Smooth. This symbol here roughly translates to demon. Demon? Well, my father read me ghost stories with that mask and symbol in it when I was young. Scared the hell out of me. And now you're using it. Peter, listen. That mask, it's... It could be connected to dangerous people. Mary Jane might want to find a different story. And do you think she's in trouble? I don't know. But why take the risk? Oh, he doesn't know. The symbol inside the mask means demon. It really spooked Mr. Lee. I've never seen him like that. He even said you should drop the story. Fat chance. Do you think Mr. Lee knows more than he's letting on? No, I think he just had a weird flashback or something. I know his childhood was pretty traumatic. Yeah, that makes sense. Demons, huh? Catchy name. Okay, gotta get writing. See you soon. You know, the business community's... Well, that went about as well as I could have hoped. Just rude. Yes. 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 Yes
Oh, that ran up. Ran over that person. Mm. Nothing like a high speed chase to keep a guy on his toes. Spider Man, I need help. Hello? Peter, it's Dr. Octavius. Oh, hey, what's up? Lance Corporal Texador is here for a fitting. I totally forgot. I mean, I mean, I, I didn't forget, forget. I just, I, I'll be there soon. His tardiness is starting to become a pattern. Yeah. Come on, Parker. You're better than this. Good going, oh, Pete. Right. How did I lose track of time? Are you okay, ma'am? Carmen, and I'm fine. It's my husband, Rodrigo. He's been acting weird, and I just found out he's meeting this woman. Well, listen, oh, I'm not okay. the best person to help with relationship problems. It's not like that. I think she's involved with bad people. Rodrigo might be in real trouble. He's scared, but he won't tell me anything. I can check it out. Any idea when he's meeting her next? Tonight, by the detox center in Greenwich. Okay. Don't worry, Carmen. I'll find out what's going on. Oh. Detox center's not far. Carmen just sent me Rodrigo's picture. Let's see if I can find him. Damn, this anime suit is quite something. That's Rodrigo. He's really nervous. Security. Carmen doesn't seem like a girlfriend. I'll get a photo and see if Carmen recognizes her. You better not hold anything back. Why would I? If that picture gets out, my life's over. Give me the plans and it won't. Very nice. Got it. Looks good. Remember, tell anyone about this. And I'll be there. Oof. Now, where could you be going? Plans. This sounds bigger than I thought. I better follow the blackmailer and find out how big. Carmen, I'm uploading a photo to you. Does this woman look familiar? No, I've never seen her. What were they talking about? Sounds like she's blackmailing him. She mentioned something about plans. My husband works security at a casino in Atlantic City. She could be planning a heist, but I'll need more evidence before I can do anything. Let me know if I can help. All right. I'm gonna see where she's taking the plans. I'll be in touch. Hang on. Oh, oh, da, da, da. Another victim or an accomplice? I need a photo. No perches with a good angle on this new guy. Looks like it's the underside of the high line. Nice clear image. Yes. As soon as he saw the photo, he fell in line. Rodrigo always was a sucker. Boss will be after him. Let's see the plan. I think that's what I'm talking about. Uh oh. Gotta catch my train. I wanna keep the boss away from me. Tonight's gonna be our biggest score yet. Hell yeah. How many people are in on this? I've gotta follow him. Getting off. Tapping into the train system should help me follow the train's path. All right, here we go. Carmen, the blackmailer met some guy under the High Line. Sounded like you knew your husband. I'm sending you the photo. That's Deshaun, Rodrigo's best friend from college. She went to prison years ago on a robbery charge. Casino plans and a criminal record. Not a great combination. I need to find out who else is in on it. If they're hitting the casino, they'll need at least a wheelman and a safe cracker. I watch a lot of heist movies. <laughs> Sounds like it. I'll let you know what I find out. Should be getting off. Wait, there's a the train. Just 
Into the line. Oh. I should head over near the subway exit and wait for him to get out. Agreed. He's heading for that office building. their positions on the map. They're on the move. Oh, here they go. I have all the evidence I need. Now I just have to stop that car. for you. See you on the flip side. Your husband's pal and his team just had their trip to beautiful Atlantic City canceled. Thank you. I spoke to Rodrigo. That blackmail photo shows him driving the night Deshaun committed the robbery. But Rodrigo didn't know about it. He was just picking up his friend. Oof. I've got a contact on the force. She'll help Rodrigo. Especially if he'll agree to testify about the blackmail. He will. Or I'll show him he needs to be a lot more afraid of me than Deshaun. <laughs> Very nice. Hmm? Oh shit, Taki mushrooms. It all took place at night. Hmm. Oh, there it is. In the shape of a Triforce. Peter, Mr. Lee spoke to me. He seemed worried. Are you into something dangerous? Oh, it's just a story Mary Jane's investigating. Don't worry. I'll make sure she's careful. Please tell me you two are back together. We're talking again. Baby steps. I hope I didn't upset Mr. Lee. He's just concerned. I was actually touched by how concerned. I knew he liked you. He admires how dedicated you are to helping others. I knew he reminded him of himself when he was younger. Both orphans, both so smart. Well, the admiration is mutual. You've got a good boss, man. I'll tell him. Uh, you, Peter. Awkward. Got a good boss. How does it work? Just like a natural arm. You think of what you want it to do, and. Yes. <laughs> What do you think you're doing? 
The site's been declared a safety hazard. Stop that right now! This is highly sensitive equipment. That's it. I'm calling the mayor's office directly. Peter Parker, how the hell are you? Speak of the devil. Oh, boy. Mr. Osborne. Oh, please. How long have we known each other? It's Mr. Mayor. <laughs> it's Norman. Norman! Norman, what do you think you're doing? The grant agreement you signed has strict safety provisions. This isn't your first violation. <laughs> Those were excused. By me. We should have confiscated this equipment long ago. But... but I've had a breakthrough. <laughs> Thank you for your great service to our country. These folks will escort you to Oscorp Robotics, where you'll receive the latest in prosthetics. No charge. This isn't about safety infractions, is it? Wow. I'm trying to help you, Otto. That's pretty ass. Be free to continue to your work in a secure environment at Oscorp. You always were the smartest guy in the room. You haven't changed a bit. Neither of you. Hey, Peter. Harry will be coming back from Europe early next year. Maybe the two of you can start that business you always talk about. This is opportunity knocking. That lady looks so fierce. Like, mm. Yeah, that's pretty messed up what you're doing, buddy. Easy, easy, easy. They didn't take everything. Maybe we could start over. Peter, there's no we. Without the grant from the city, I can no longer pay you. I need some time to think. If I were you, I'd look for a new job. And also, that is how villains are made. <laughs> 